so much for coming tonight and supporting Tibet House. And here we are right now. This is beautiful. So that song was about a young woman who works in a convenience store somewhere in the American desert and um, comes from a difficult background and, um, but has an interest in astronomy and finds herself on the roof of a convenience store at 3 in the morning uh, learning something new about our galaxy and uh, somehow applying that to her life. So there's that. All right. Every time, uh, every time I come to, well, to that house has offered me so much over the years with Helen Ginsburg and uh, Patty Smith, of course, the Thurmans and Philip Glass, and tonight Taj Mahal, all the other performers who are here. It's always such an incredible honor to, um, to be able to um, stand amongst these people, uh, either completely present in the moment uh, or uh, in my memory. And I send this next one to a lot of people, all the people I mentioned, uh, but also to Chessa, who was a great friend. Last time I saw him before this year. And I love you too. <laughs> In some unknown way. <laughs> and let's keep it going there. <laughs> um, but that didn't turn me on track at all. This, um, this next song is brand new to you and also to me. It's the first time Paul had performed this. Um, I rehearsed it. Uh, well, you know the joke about Carnegie Hall. Of course, we all know that joke. In my case, um, I get it by not practicing. But I was able to uh, sit at Mike Mills' uh, kitchen table uh, the, other, the other morning in Los Angeles and run through the chords so I could present them to Tony. And, um, and we can play here tonight. This is off of the next uh, R.E.M. record. And it's a song. Um, this is a song called uh, Every Day is Yours to Know. With the walk, Talk and the tick tock clock, with the rock and the roll, and the bridge and the toll, with the brilliance and the light, and the stink and the fight, and the road.
Yes. Yeah.